also called omphalitis or mushy chick disease. Yolk sac infection is one of the most common causes of mortality in chicks during the first week after hatching. E. Coli can be involved as the primary and sole causal agent or as a secondary opportunist. This infection can be associated with a thickened, inflamed navel, where the route of infection is via the unhealed navel, or bacteria can multiply in the hatching egg following fecal contamination of the shell. Mortality due to yolk sac infection can reach 100% in a batch of chicks within the first week of life, but deaths usually range between 5% and 10%. Other bacteria such as Bacillus cereus, Staphylococci, Pseudomonas aeruginosa, Proteus spp, and Clostridia can also cause yolk sac infection, either on their own or commonly in conjunction with E. coli. E. coli multiplies rapidly in the intestines of newly hatched chicks, and infection spreads rapidly from chick to chick in hatcheries and brooders. A hatching environment that lacks sufficient humidity or which with unsuitable temperature is often associated with a high incidence of yolk sac infection. Clinically, affected chicks appear depressed, with distended abdomens and a tendency to huddle. Sometimes, the navel is visibly thickened, prominent, and necrotic. Mortality in brooding environments can be considerable. Affected carcasses may emit a distinctive putrefying smell. Post-mortem examinations reveal a septicemic carcass with engorged and dilated subcutaneous and yolk sac blood vessels. The lungs are usually congested, while the liver and kidneys are dark and swollen. The characteristic finding is an inflamed, unabsorbed yolk sac with abnormal yolk color and consistency. The yolk may be yellow and inspissated or brownish-green and watery, often fetid. Peritonitis with hemorrhages in the serosal surfaces of the intestines is a regular feature. Diagnosis depends on the isolation and identification of E. coli with samples recovered from the abdominal viscera, particularly the yolk sac. Prevention and control are best achieved by providing optimal brooding conditions and ensuring that chicks are healthy, sourced from well-managed breeding flocks and hatcheries. Critical aspects include good hatching egg hygiene on breeder farms and effective cleansing and disinfection in hatcheries. Treatment is not recommended. Although antibiotic therapy may appear to reduce mortality, recovered chicks are likely to be uneven and not commercially viable. Please feel free to ask in comments. Subscribe channel. Thank you.